Warm it all up. Everything you got. Come on, you hey. You want to live forever? Guys, I'm um, just doing a close-up video now at the range um, of the uh, Morita Fleet Carbine from Starship Troopers. Um, <clears throat> this gun in the movie uh, was chambered in 762 by 51 NATO. Clearly, we know that's not the case. In real life, they used two rifles for the Morita assault rifle and the Morita carbine. Uh, they used uh, Ruger Mini 14s for a lot of them, and uh, they used the Ruger AC 556 assault rifles or machine guns uh, for the full auto uh, live fire scenes or blank fire, I should say. Um, this gun right here, uh, this was actually Patrick Muldoon's gun, the character, the actor who plays uh, Xander. Um, these were actually screen used from the movie. Um, when I got them, they were just the fiberglass shells that were used for the film. Obviously there wasn't a real AC 556 machine gun inside of it. Uh, so I did a little bit of work inside and I uh, put a Mini-14 live fire back inside of it in 5.56. Uh, it is unloaded. Um, here's a magazine. Stainless. Uh, this is an older Mini-14 stainless mag with some fancy shroud on it to make it look futuristic. It looks pretty cool. Uh, this is a real M60 flash hider from an M60 machine gun, just like they used for the film. Um, I have a dummy cartridge right here. Uh, it has a primer pop. Uh, I'll show you loading. I'll just, I'll just put one around there and show you. It is a bull pop, so it obviously loads from the back. This one's getting away. Reject it. Right. Locks back when unloaded. Close that. Um, on this side, uh, this is the actual sling that was used for the film. Uh, there was a tag on there, I believe it said where it was from. A uh, Booney Packer slings. So, this was on it when I got it from, from the prop store. Um, both sides. Uh, I also have this. I got the Certificate of Authenticity. I'll show. So that's a letter from the uh, lead armor of the movie, Robert uh, Galati. And here is the, uh, the prop store uh, the certificate of authenticity to show that it is legit. So that's pretty much it. Thanks. Yeah.